What's up guys? I'm Shane. Welcome back to the first era of our relegation league. Alright, so it's actually been a couple weeks since I recorded this, so I'm just going to real quick go through and give you a rundown on recruiting. I made a couple changes. So first off, 75 overall wide receiver. We have the lead on him. He was a 71 overall, but I went through, took some points away, and fully scouted everyone now that we can do it in one shot. This tackle I was going after went all the way down to 65. He was a bust. We're still going after him. 71 overall wide receiver is actually a 67. Still got 88 speed, so that's still pretty good for us. This DN we're leading on got a plus one, so that's always nice. And right now I'm going to try and make a pitch here at Jesse Smith. He's a 74 overall DN. That'll solidify the defensive line for the rest of this. Walter Allen, a four-star quarterback. He'd be great because, again, Royal we have to lean on, but he's a junior already, so we're only going to have two or three years of him, depending on if I redshirt him. So we're going to need someone for those last couple years. Unfortunately, this guy's got 73 accuracy. All right, this week we're going to Buffalo. They're one of the worst teams in our conference left, so we really got to win this one if we want to do anything at all this season. And by anything at all, I mean just get the six wins in a bowl. Even that's a lot. If we lose here, we fall to two and five. And if we lose again next week and fall to two and six, that's probably a wrap on this season. There's not really much reason to go forward. So let's see if we can't get victory number three. All right, let's see if we can't get these interceptions under control by uh, running the ball some more. I guess not. Ooh, Barnes got open. Threw that a little too inaccurately, but he got to it. All right, third and two. I'm just handing the ball off. Like, yeah, no matter what, I'm just going to hand the ball off on these things. I don't want more getting injured. Because uh, even when it is the right option to keep it with more, he only gets like one or two yards anyways. I'd rather just take the risk. All right, so the UMass PA smash has showed up here. Now, last time they called this, it worked brilliantly. Can it work again? Looks like it. Not a touchdown this time, but still a big game. 19 to Mason. Nice curl route. Good job, Barnes. Ooh, a good pancake from our center there. Oh, they have this middle cleared out. I wonder if I can get Robinson wide open on this. Oh, yeah, it's a blitz. Falls into the end zone. All right. We strike first, up 6 nothing. Hopefully we get this extra point. Ooh, Notre Dame barely eats one out against Temple. That's, uh, that's not looking good for us. If I was in better position on that, he's going to make some terrible reads today, apparently. So I need to get right as a defender today. Oh, I read that. I shot in the first gap I saw instead of uh, actually following him. He was bouncing it all the way to the outside, and I came in the first gap. I don't have that burst. Oh, yeah, we just got walloped at the line. He managed to do a stumble recovery well enough to get that all the way for first down. Oh, no. Ah. He, yeah, he overpursued, and I took him over, and he froze and sp uh, I got to stop switching. Good job by Mason, though. It, he's a 66 overall. Why is he so reliable as a pass catcher? Oh, another big blitz. I led Robinson over the top. That was probably a mistake, but he managed to make a really, really incredible catch. Oh, no, 65. He didn't even block him. He, like, dove at him at the last second. Yeah, see, like, he... He just... I don't know. How did you miss that? You're running in a straight line across. I saw a circle run up, but I don't think I had the throw on the run or the throw power to get it to him. All right, defense. Special teams actually put you in a real good spot. Got him pinned down to the eight. So plenty of chances for you to screw it up, I guess. Yeah, like that. Nope. Oh, who's 21? Because he just got slapped up. Was that Fry? All right, no one's covering the halfback now. That's... Oh, I whiffed. Tried for the hit stick. Nothing. Mm. And 
him just like that. Yeah, good thing we pinned him down at the eight, I guess. Oh, there, there were some blocks. Now, he's got 87 speed. He's actually not the slowest running back I've ever dealt with. I believe in North Texas, uh, Scott Hardy has 89 speed or 88. So he's not even that slow. I don't know if his acceleration is any good. But, man, just... The offensive line isn't there to get us by with a power back. Definitely a blitz incoming. And Robinson holds on. Thank you. I'm trying not to do as many adjustments. I really want to see how bad this team is. So tackles just on normal, but I did put conservative catch on. These guys aren't making any moves after the catch. Let's be 100% honest. Good catch, Mason. Brings that to a manageable third and one. And a read option again. We're, we're just giving it to Robinson every time. Nice little 12-yard run. Wraps up the first quarter, down 14 to 7, but we're driving. Mason holds on again, though. The non-play action PA smash. Barnes open. Pushed out at the 4. All right, let's get another touchdown on the board, guys. Johnson holds on to it. Ah, oh, not quite in the end zone. Close, right on the goal line. Looking for Mason on the out here, I think. Yep. We're on the goal line. They, they're going to bring the blitz, so we always have an opportunity to get a wide open pass. And it's almost always the tight end uncovered on that. Oh, he finally took off. There he goes. Taken down for a sack. Why do I feel like this is a screenplay? It's not. Bring it up. Thank you. Oh, over the top. Fry. After getting annihilated earlier in the game, got a good swat in there. Forces him to a punt. It's not likely, but it'd be great if we could run out the clock here. It'd also be great if we could hold a block for more than half a second. Oh, big run. Oh my god, Robinson, go! Holy cow! All the way down to the five! On a read option. And there's a clipping call. Never mind. I knew that looked too good to be true. God damn it, Montgomery. Oh, I called a slant play for Fuller on that. Thank God. Oh yeah, Mason, nobody around him. Good truck, too. Ah, uh, again, the chip block. No one's actually getting a block on these linebackers. They're just lightly shoving them. Yeah, I was about to say, I we can't make this field goal. It's a little too ambitious for us. All right, well, good good conversion for Fuller, at least. Hey, we might actually run out this clock, though. Doesn't matter if we don't score. Oh, he read that. Oh, thank God he dropped it. That's my first terrible pass on the day. I, I thought he was his own. When I went to go throw that, I'm like, oh, he's going to break wide open there. No, it was man. He was just playing inside. And wait as long to take off for once. Slide down, first down. We're on the 13-yard line. They want me to call a Hail Mary. Why? How do you keep leaving Mason open? He's just a guaranteed 10 yards. Look, 7 catches, 70 yards. Guaranteed 10 yards every time. And Robinson gets in for a rushing touchdown. Back on top. With a PAT up 21-14. 38 seconds, so hopefully we stop them from scoring. Oh, if that had been a pick right there. If Walker could have gotten his hands on that and caught that ball. And we could have gone up two scores. Because I would have just taken a knee and kicked the field goal. Oh. Well, that's points for them. Hopefully it's just a field goal. He's taken off. We take him down. They're going to burn a timeout. And they're going to go for a field goal here. Oh, well, we're going to the halftime up 21-17. to 17. They're going to get the ball to start, but at least we're in the lead. So defense, did I already get my one stop you're going to give me today? Or can we expect another one out of you? Oh, Henry. Dang it. Oh, the blitz helped. For once. 
That was Henry on the tackle, too. Oh, good TFL there. Nice job, Peterson. Oh, well, the guy I'm supposed to be blocking glitched out. Oh, no. Oh, he dropped it. Oh, well, thank God. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> hey, a stop's a stop, man. All right, we're starting all the way back on the 14. But we got the lead and the ball for once. Oh, good hands, Montgomery. He actually held on to it. That wasn't an easy catch to make. Again, Mason on a drag route. He, we're not even beating him on, like, deep patterns. It's just no one bothers to cover the tight end for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, we actually only want to pass to, like, two tight ends. That's what this playbook is entirely built on. I was about to look and figure out which one of these guys is supposed to be Khalil Mack, but uh, he already graduated. Wow, okay. That was an incredible catch by Hawthorne. I didn't throw him the ball. I threw it in circle. So, nice awareness. Oh, Johnson. I don't know why that safety just sort of stopped. And a face mask penalty? Just keep tacking him on. I'll take it at the nine-yard line. But Folks manages to hold on to it. Touchdown pass to some guy I'd never even heard of before. Sweet. Oh, somehow that wasn't pass interference on me. Thank you. I ran right into him. Oh. Well, that blitz worked. All right, we can't run man coverage to save our lives today. Oh my god. Mm. Ooh, more! Big run on a read option for him. That's the first time I've kept it with him today. And I thought Montgomery didn't have that block, but managed to cut that back around to the inside. More importantly, I managed to not kill him. Could Okay, we had four offensive linemen and one cornerback. No one wanted to cover him. This is why I don't run screens. End of the third quarter. We're up 28 to 24, but we got a third and long right about here. So hopefully we can convert. All right, the way I see it, every time we run this play, Mason's going to catch it for about 19. So he's either going to catch this for a first down or it's going to be an incompletion. Oh, he fought. That was actually the shortest one yet. Mason on an out route. That's dangerous. Oh, no, he was on an in. I thought he was on an out. Hey, the way, he was open. Another one for us. All right. Running the read option in the other game, and he was getting tackled for like two yards even when he was open because he was so slow. Luckily, it looks like it's working out a lot better for us today. And a good counter play by Robinson. All right, the running game's starting to come into effect finally. I mean, he's still averaging 2.8 yards a carry, but... 45 yards. Oh, Montgomery with a good catch. Thank you for holding on to that one. I don't want to chew clock yet. It might seem like it's a reasonable thing to do. But we're only up by four. Looks like they're expecting the run again. Now, oh, Mason still caught that one. Let him just enough. All right, guys, I don't care about if you get a stop or not. Just don't let them keep getting first downs. Let them choose some of this clock themselves. Or get that for a negative one yard rush. Way to go, Oliver, whoever you are. I had the read on that one. Let's go. Oh, good stop. Fourth and four. What are they going to do? They're probably going to go for this, right? Now they're going to punt it. Oh. This defense. I mean, this is the best all-around game we have played as a team this entire season. I know the competition is trash, but week one, we lost the, FC we lost the FCS. Right? Like, we're still pretty tr Oh, my God, Henry. <laughs> oh, my God, Henry. I think that... No, that wasn't even me. I thought I took off too early. We managed to not allow a touchdown on four drives. No points at all on three of them. 
That is remarkable for us. Hundred yards rushing. That I don't know if that's the first time we've done it all season, but that's been there. No big turnovers. Knock on wood. I'm actually going to be able to choose some clock here. Oh, this is nice. See now, like it's actually opening up. We're up to 3.2 yard average. Either way, they're not going to get the ball back until there's about a minute left on the clock. Well, they're going to use some timeouts. They'll have about a minute left. Or they'll have no timeouts. Like, one of the two. Yeah, here come the timeouts. Second and 11. Please be expecting a run. They weren't. Oh, nice catch, Barnes. That was beautiful. That puts more over 300 yards now. Only four incompletions today. What a game for him. Oh my god, Hawthorne open up the middle. I'm just like... We're, we're going after a, who turned out to be a 67 overall tight end. And if he's going to take Hawthorne's spot, that's pretty pathetic. I think Hawthorne's going to be better than him. But I don't know what year Hawthorne is. Alright, let's just run this ball a couple times. Let's get out of here. Maybe kick a field goal at the end. Good block. 65. Who is that? Oh my god. Robinson got injured because 65 can't throw a block. On a pole. I need to stop running anything with a pole. Yeah, 65, our right guard. And I ran something with a pole again. It's all right. Kill some clock. Yeah, see? He pulled. It did not cover this guy. This is the hardest 24-yard field goal I've ever seen in my life. But we got it. Oh, my God. That is so nice. When you don't throw a million interceptions. I forgot what that felt like for a little bit. More well-earned player of the game. Four incompletions, four touchdowns, 53 on the ground. What a game, man. Good job. Man, we just won a game by 14 points. Didn't have to sweat it out till the end either. And considering how it started, I thought it was going to be just a regular shootout. But we came to play in the second half, and they didn't. All right, so final stats on the day. Again, Daryl Moore, 33-37, 337 yards, four touchdowns, no picks. Took two sacks, but I think it was for a combined, like, five yards. Rushing Robinson with 66 yards and a touchdown, a 2.8 average. He suffered a little bit because I handed off to him basically every single time I ran a read option. But even still, it was, like, the worst he had was, like, a negative one-yard loss. Just, unfortunately, we run to the right side of the line, and our right guard has been complete trash all game, as you saw. Probably all season, and that might be our biggest, like, I might have to redo the depth chart. Moore also contributing 53 yards on the ground. And Folks, two for zero. David Mason, 13 catches, 125 yards, two touchdowns. He, I don't know if he's the best tight end we've ever had, but this offense clearly loves tight ends. And he's taking advantage of it. 67 overall. Did he go up a point or did I remember that wrong? Robinson, four catches, 27 yards and a touchdown. Barnes had four for 65. Montgomery, three for 30. Hawthorne, 3 for 36. He's a 63 overall redshirt junior. Oh my god. Johnson had 3 for 28. Fuller had 2 for 17, but they were clutch. And Folk somehow snuck in there. One catch, 9 yards, and a touchdown. Defense, Hawk led the day with 6 tackles, and Fry had 5 more. Never good when your safeties are leading in tackles. TFLs, Oliver, Peterson, and Huff all had one. Huff managed to grab a sack. Lowe, Fry, and Walker all with pass deflections, but... Walker's was such an easy interception it could have been. That was a six-point swing. Luckily, it didn't matter for us. But that pass swat by Fry, whew, that was impressive. All right, so I thought for sure there would only be a couple games left this season, but it looks like we might have to play the full 12. Because I think once we, like I said, seven losses, and we're pretty much going to call it a season and super sim the rest. But uh, we might just go six and six evenly. Good God. Although we got some real tough opponents coming up. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please be sure to hit like down below. If you want to see more from me, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell to get it delivered directly to your inbox every single time I upload. If you have any suggestions, again, I'm bulk recording, so I might not see it right away, but any options you got as far as the playbook, as far as how to keep my DNs on the field more once I get some good guys in here, leave all that down in the comment section below. Everything you leave down there, I will always respond to, unless you are the trolliest of trolls. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Shane. I'm out.